Hi, my name is Derek Watson. I'm a dentist in East Kent in the UK and uh, I'm doing a series of short videos to explain uh, the answers to questions that people come in and commonly ask. So, And today what we're, go we're going to do is uh, what is a root treatment. Now, um, you may find yourself needing a root treatment unexpectedly, um, possibly because you've had a swollen face or some, some quite severe pain from a tooth. and um, it's, sometimes it's called a root canal treatment, sometimes it's called a root treatment. There's a bit of confusion. It's all the same procedure. A dentist would tend to call it endodontics, which is just a professional name for it. And basically it means cleaning out the inside of a tooth. Now we're all familiar with uh, filling a tooth, what we, we think of as a tooth. In fact, what gets filled is the top of the tooth, the bit that sticks up through the gum, the bit that we call the crown. And uh, of course there's a lot, like an iceberg, there's a lot more tooth underneath the uh, gum line. And every tooth has a nerve, an artery and a vein running through it. So I can show you that here. There's a, here's a model of a, uh, this is a premolar, this is a molar. And if we take the front off, you can see that uh, inside each tooth is uh, a vein, an artery and a nerve running through the middle of the tooth, which is hollow to the, uh, and connecting to the main nerve bundle underneath. Now, uh, for various reasons, these nerves may die. Um, quite commonly, it's because the tooth had decay in it, or it's been filled umpteen times and it just gets fed up. And uh, Obviously, a lot depends on the, the blood supply coming through this tiny hole at the bottom here, so that gets compromised. For example, if the tooth banged uh, or was subject to trauma, then what happens is that the, the, the circulation inside this tooth pretty well um, packs up. And uh, if the uh, it's invaded by decay from the top, then again, decay will get inside. So what happens is I can sort of show you is that the, the tooth then, the nerve, the nerve then dies off. And so you're left with a tooth which is hollow and uh, initially empty, but very quickly becomes full of bacteria and uh, the bacteria multiply and they tend to um, come out the only way they can, which is through the tip of the root and that then causes a lot of pain, a lot of pressure, and eventually swollen face. So the way to try and save the tooth is to make a small hole in the top and to put some cleaning instruments down the inside of the tooth and clean it out. And that's what a root canal treatment is. Basically, it's us making a small hole in the top of the tooth, uh, which has to be filled in again afterwards, and uh, sticking a load of um, pipe cleaners down the tooth to try and clean the tooth out. Now it's uh, it's a complicated procedure and it's not a cheap procedure and, and you know people do get taken aback a bit by the cost. Um, the reason is that um, root treatment is um, is probably one of the most complicated things that dentists do. It's extremely fiddly, it's extremely time consuming, you have to be very patient and you have to do it to a very high standard. And by high standard I mean that, um, here's, a, here's another um, illustration of a tooth. But this is where we're trying to fill down to, and if you can imagine that we're, we're trying to fill to this point and no less and no longer, and we are working to accuracies typically of a point uh, one of a millimeter, so one tenth of a millimeter uh, to, to, the, to the root tip. So um, it, uh, it doesn't take a long time. The common questions we get asked about root trims is, it, is it gonna take a long time? Is it gonna take a lot of visits? It doesn't have to. If it can be done in one visit, then that's good. Um, it doesn't uh, improve the success rate to do it over two or three visits. It doesn't improve the success rate to have antiseptic uh, put inside the tooth, to try and sterilise the tooth or anything. The best thing to do is get in there, clean it out, fill it up, and, and job done. The, um, uh, the other questions we get asked are, is it painful? Well, it's all done under local anaesthetic. If you've got a big swelling done, um, if you've got a big swelling, then you may need antibiotics and you may need to have the tooth, uh, have some antiseptic put inside the tooth. Um, but um, otherwise, it's pretty routine, but it's, you know, as I say, it's fiddly, it's boring. It might take an hour. To do a multi-rooted tooth, basically, if you've got a three-rooted tooth, then you're doing three root treatments. And so that's, again, that's why the cost is more for back teeth. For front teeth tend to be single-rooted, they tend to be less expensive. But anyway, if you've got any questions about root treatment and uh, what to, um, you know, what to do, or any other uh, dental treatments, then please um, put them in the questions below, and I shall try and answer as many as I can. 
and please uh, give this video a like if you want to try and help um, I'm sorry about the noise that's the sterilizer going in the background uh, if you want to help other people find our videos then give us a like and uh, I'll talk to you next time